From Drakensink. Hey, what's up? This is Drakensink with a new gameplay video. This time I'll be playing a game called Retaliate, as you can see right here. I'm playing this game using the Bluestacks app. You can play Android games and mobile games on the PC. And Retaliate, I've been asked to do a gameplay video for this, so that's what I'm doing. It is a side scrolling space shooter, I believe. I put more information in the description box. It is developed by a company called Romans XVI or by a guy called Austin. I put more information in the description box. More about that. But let's go ahead and get started. Okay. That was just a preview. Looks like ammunition shot. So the gameplay is like um, old school space shooters, where the screen you don't actually move. I don't think, just the screen moves. Purchasing some ammunition or something. Okay. Here we go. Welcome to Retaliate. You are a valiant space hero who, in his misfortune, has run out of ammo. Ever since the inter interplanetary weapon <laughs> weaponry nullification, IPON, it is now impossible to buy more ammo. Okay, continue. Because this down here is like your health bar or your shield or something like that. Then you see your ammo count right there, bottom right. Now it is just you and your trusted shield. Use it to absorb your enemies' attacks and fire the acquired ammo right back at them. Okay. So you absorb their bullets and you fire back at them. Interesting. You start each round with absolutely no ammo. Interesting concept. So click continue and your shield will only last a few seconds at any given moment. Okay. Look and look an enemy approaches. Use your shield to block his attack. Okay. Press here to shield. I got killed. Oh you have to hold it down, okay? I'm playing this with the blue stacks app, so it's a little different until I get a tablet. But let's see, good. Now that you have acquired his ammo, fire it back at him. I'll be playing some games on a real tablet next week. So I'll try that out. I'll probably um, record them and then I'll talk more about that in a gaming update next week. Okay, good. Now that you have acquired this ammo, fire it back at him. Okay. Press here to fire. Not bad. He just stood there and then dodge or anything. So. Great job, it's time to retaliate. Left, press the left screen to block. Alright, just got a leaderboard or something. Let's go back. I'm not exactly sure how you move. Uh, let's see. How do you move around? So your shield actually recharges. I don't know how you move around though. It's a little interesting. I think it's better if I play on a tablet. <laughs> but it's hard to record it when I'm playing it on the tablet. Alright, restarted the game. I'm on the main menu again. Looks like on this bottom slider right here, you can change the difficulty. I think it's the difficulty. Got easy, normal, hard, and extreme. Let's just check out um, how it varies. Let's try easy first. Okay. 
I would play this on a tablet because it is designed for a tablet, but it's hard for me to record. There's a reason why. I can still play it on here, but it looks like you need to tilt your screen. Tilt your screen in order to move, so I don't know how you do that right here. Also got a scoreboard up there. Your shield can actually destroy the enemies as well. Only these ships ships are coming after me. The other ones just stay back. So it is a pretty interesting concept. Your shield absorbs the bullets and then you can fire it back at them. So you don't actually get bullets when you um, destroy those other enemies. Unfortunately, I can't uh, tilt my screen since I'm playing on. Um, I'm playing with the blue stacks out. Does it look like I can tilt it? I guess you have to destroy all of the, um, cause I don't see a timer or anything. I think you have to get to a certain number of score points, score points, or you have to destroy all those, um, ships that are firing at you. They're moving right into my line of sight, so I guess it doesn't really matter too much. Looks like if you want to remove ads, then you have to pay a dollar. If you want to support the um, developer as well, I guess. Looks like it does have controller support by the image on the screen right here. Has controller support. Uh, let's see. Well, this is designed for phones, so I don't know about tablets. But hopefully it's designed for tablets as well. Let's go ahead and play. Nice music in the background. I don't know if there's boss battles or not. I have not gotten that far yet. So you click on the left screen to use the shield and the right screen to fire the bullets back. I don't know if you have upgrades as well. Like in some um, flying games you could you get like spread shots, homing missiles, you know things like that. Machine gun, laser gun, different type of guns. I don't know if it has it on this game or not. Okay. Let's try to get to at least, I don't know, 500 points or something. I just need those ships to get in the middle, get in my line of sight. Because uh, a pit, unfortunately I can't move around. I have to tilt the screen to move, but unfortunately I can't tilt the screen. 
since I'm on the computer. Once I get the tablet, then I will try it out some more. But I can't record that. That's the, that's the unfortunate part. But I will try it out once I get the tablet. Not too bad though. I can still get the, those ships as long as I time my shots. And I'm missing them like crazy now. I got seven more to go. <laughs> Spoke too soon. Oh, I got 500. Okay. Job well done. I did accomplish at least 500 at least. Let's just ramp it up to extreme. See how how di how different it looks. Probably more ships. Auto ships are moving as well, really fast. The bullets are going faster. The ships are falling faster. Your shield gets depleted faster as well. Got a different variety of ships as well. Oh, they got shooting laser guns and stuff. Thankfully, they're just standing still. Oh, we got ships that are dropping missiles and all kinds of ships. Only got 80 for that one. Enjoy retaliate. Why not raid it? Okay, why not? Sure. All right. I heard there's gamepad support, so let's try that out right now since I can't really move too good. Let's see if the gamepad support works. I saw a 360 controller icon on these screenshots. Okay, enable that. Okay. Enable the gamepad. And the gamepad is not functioning. Okay, let me click play first. Yeah, the gamepad is not functioning for me right now. Let's go ahead and raid it then. Let's go to the Play Store and wait. Rate it. Rate this app. I give it. Honestly, I will give it. I have not been able to try it with a tablet really. I did like the extreme mode, though. <laughs> that was pretty interesting. I did not run across any upgrades or boss battles, but I don't know. Right now, I'll give it a 4, I guess. Once I try it on a tablet, then I'll think about giving it a 5, maybe. I think a 4 is not bad. Leave some room for improvement.